がちょうどうちの近所に朗読教室というのがありました。And then I started to get really interested, and I thought, what, how could I go about performing in front of people? And I discovered in my neighborhood there was actually a classroom that they were giving lessons in recitation. So, there was a little bit of 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 a little bit And this was called recitation on stage. It wasn't just about people reading together in a group, but people would take turns sitting up on the stage and performing in front of others in small, small theatrical rooms. And then I, here I am, I got into recitation. <laughs> The next question is the difference between recitation and just reading aloud. How do you actually get to become a recital?
それが「滅びの美学」というのを大名を付けさせていただきました。And for that reason, I actually I titled this performance The Aesthetics of Ruin. ございました。とでは会場の皆さんに質問させていただきます。これ、これで質問をするようです。皆さん、皆さん、皆さん、皆さん、皆さん、皆さん、皆さん、皆さん、皆さん、皆さん、皆さん、皆さん、皆さん、皆さん、皆さん、皆さん、皆さん、皆さん、皆さん、皆さん、皆さん、皆さん、皆さん、皆さん、皆さん、皆さん、皆さん、皆
So the, the difference between if you do contemporary works is more or less the life that we're living in, we, we understand that. But in order to do these classical works, you really need to somehow imagine this as if you're living in those times. And that's a very important thing. I'd like to mention that um, Mr. Solta appeared today in Professor Bonner's class. It's a fourth year Japanese class. And they were reading a short story by Asada Jiro called Hina Mahama. And the students all studied it. They read it in the original. And then we were very fortunate she came to the classroom today and performed it for them. And we got some really amazing comments. So we're getting a lot of live attacks. It's really wonderful to have a contemporary work today. It's a short story from um, Asada Jiro, 1998 or so. Well, thank you very much. Um, I like to um, yes, uh, let's have one more round of applause. Um,